This time, there has been news about a new crypto called Squid Game, and has quickly turned into a multi-million dollar scam. In this video, we are going to explain what the Squid Game crypto is, the reasons for its rapid growth, and how the Squid Game's crypto scam worked. Hey everybody, it's Acho6. This channel's focus is to bring you up to speed on topics of the cryptocurrency world by making it easier for you to understand the information presented in the videos. This will be done through analogies, stories, and examples. So, what is the Squid Game crypto? Well, the Squid Game is a cryptocurrency token like Polkadot, Cardano, and Solana, but it isn't a mean crypto. Inspired by the hugely popular South Korean Netflix series Squid Game, in this currency called Squid, people can earn tokens by playing online games or play to earn cryptocurrency which can be exchanged for other cryptocurrencies or national currencies. According to the Squid Project's white paper, the game was offered as a way to play an upcoming online game based on the series. Is it related to the South Korean Netflix series? Maybe you've been wondering whether the Netflix series is involved with this new crypto. The answer is no. The South Korean show is in no way associated with or affiliated with Squid Game Crypto. The crypto shows that the Netflix series has a big influence in the coin even if it isn't involved. The price of Squid Game coin surged in the last few days after its launch in late October. According to CoinMarketCap data, the token skyrocketed in price from about 0 0.01 on October 26 to around $38 on October 31st. The price then rose to about $90 early November 1st, then spiked to above $2,861 before falling to 0 0.0034. All this in the same day, Monday, November 1st. The Scam it seems that the cryptocurrency inspired by the Netflix series has turned out to be a scam, with its developers reportedly making off with more than $3 million. This is a gigantic red flag. The big problem here is people buying into something too quickly that they don't understand. People only saw that it was connected to Squid Game. I watched that show, and I think it's cool. They said it was a play to get tokens, and it's a hot new concept where you play a game, and the more you play, the more tokens you earn. Unfortunately, there was no real game to play except that you put in your money and buy the token. Then you can't withdraw your money. Recent reports from buyers show they cannot sell their squid tokens and cash out their gains. In the only available venue, PancakeSwap. The website of the project before disappearing was full of typos, which was another red flag. The Twitter account for the project, which had gained 57,000 followers, did not allow replies and then was blocked due to unusual activity. There was no information about the founding members. All the founders are not on LinkedIn. There were also fake comments in support of it from Elon Musk. The fact that the chart never fell, instead constantly rising, was another clue. This is not the first time scammers have tried to take advantage of popular TV shows. There was a cryptocurrency called Mando, created in April based on Disney's The Mandalorian, which turned out to be a scam. On the Binance Smart Chain, it was an attractive token, but people quickly realized that it was a classic rug pull. We have plenty of rug pulls in our industry. More than 40,000 investors kept their tokens after the crash, but investors appear to have lost all hope of getting their money back. My advice to people would be, maybe you shouldn't invest a lot of money in a token tied to a TV show that didn't exist two weeks ago. In the crypto world before buying, investors should read document releases, check technical information and crypto white papers, while understanding the associated risk with crypto projects. Subscribe and turn on notifications so you don't miss more videos helping you invest in crypto, and I'll see you in the next video. Take care.